Hello everyone, welcome back. This is 1940, turn three for Italy. Um, things in the Med have not been going all that well for them, but they have a plan to try and take some territory back. So let's see how it goes. Let's start now. So they're gonna buy uh, with 21 IPC, they're gonna buy a fighter for 10 and three infantry for nine. They have a two pronged attack coming towards Egypt. First, they're going to try and do the naval fight. And if they win that, then with their amphibious force and a force coming across the desert, they will attack the British 8th Army there in Egypt. Okay, so let's get some stuff set up. Sorry. Okay, let's do this. Let's get everything on the board. So let's see. Let's see here. Yeah. Two, three, four. And then there's also two destroyers. I'm sorry. Okay. Don't know if this is going to work, but gotta at least try something. Right. Or actually, whoops, no. Oh yeah, no, that's right, yep. All right, so Italy's going in with a sub and two destroyers, two fighters and a bomber against two destroyers, an aircraft carrier, a, car a cruiser, a tactical, and a fighter. Oh, this is probably not gonna work. But I am hoping I am hoping against hope that this will work. Okay, so so they got three for two, the sub and two destroyers, so three for two. Not then. Okay, the two fighters for three. Ooh, no, and then and the bomber for four. Well, let's see, as the Brits, you know what? We'll take the hit on the carrier. So now we have a damaged carrier. Um, yeah, I don't know if I really want to pursue another. We got to risk it, so we might as well just try one more. All right, three for two. Nothing. Two for three. One for four. Okay, we'll take the British destroyer on that one. And then, oh, wait a minute. Nope, stop. I didn't even do the first counterattack. Whoopsies. All right, so the allies have three for two. That's one. Two for three. One. And one for four. Miss. Okay, yeah, no, we are, okay. So, we're not going to do a second. We are going to retreat. We're going to retreat the entire force back to the Malta area. Which, actually, since we can't attack... Which, since we're not able to, um, so instead I think what we'll do is maybe we'll just go everyone into at least Alexandria. No, we'll keep Alexandria. I think instead we'll just attack Malta. Maybe cut that off and just attack Malta instead. That way at least then. Oh wait. One, two, yeah. No, instead I'm just going to drop the... I mean this is going to kind of be non-combat, but they're just going to drop off in... Tobruk as well. 
Okay, so that's the Italian turn. That did not go anywhere how I wanted it to go. So we can use non-combat at this point. So we have a massive force here into Brook. I'm going to have to reduce that, chip some stuff out later. Um, meanwhile, up here, I'm at least going to transfer this tank to help the Germans up north. But other than that, I don't think I can really move anything else. So then we'll deploy. We'll put one infantry in northern Italy. Actually, we're going to put the infantry in southern France. And then we're going to put the fighter in southern France. All right. So, at the end of the turn, the Italians get 18. And they have met none of their objectives. All right, so that's the end of Italy, turn three, and we'll kick it over to the Anzacs and the French.